Hello everyone, welcome back to So Kelly Riffic. Today we are back here at Knott's Berry Farm. Um, we decided to come a little later today just because it has been so hot, but it's still a little hot in the park as of now. We're here like around 5 p.m. We're gonna be here till closing, so we're gonna see like if the lines die down and just see if maybe we can get on a few rides. But if we don't get on any rides, we'll walk around, see if there's any updates, but we're just gonna have like a nice chill, relax time. So come along and let's go. Okay, so I tried to get a little not scary farm update. I looked through the crack and you can see like the maze it is being worked on. And that maze actually looks pretty big. And as you can see, they also have some props. So I was looking at that. So pretty cool, cannot wait for scary farm. Got Littles out playing tic-tac-toe. We got Dave, well, we got his butt. Dave! Trying to look at some more updates over here. Still looking the same. I don't want to put my camera inside, but. All right, here at the prop shop pizzeria, it looks as though the sign has gone up and it says, your shop on the corner, Cordy's Corner advertisement. And right below looks like this little beer wine refreshment area is now open. You can now order some drinks right out of this window if you don't want food. So pretty convenient as well. I'm gonna stop in a Cordy's Corner because I like to just see if they have any new items. So let's go take a look. All right, something new I noticed is that they have this Camp Snoopy. Let me take it down. And it says Camp Snoopy. Happy campers. This is so cute. All right, I don't know if you can see, but it has the little ears and this is $20. And for those of you who are a fan of DJ Lance, look, he has like his own book here at Knott's too, the ABCs of Awesomeness. They also have these pins. That is so cool. But not only do they have this, they have this cute little like keychain. You are awesome. They have some t-shirts for adults. DJ's Lens Rock in yellow. They also have it in gray. They also have these shirts for kids. DJ Lens Rock in yellow. Okay, so I wanted to come to Fiesta Village just to check on the update, the construction status of this area. So I'm just gonna walk around and try to peek through what I could find. <laughs> See if there's any progress here in Fiesta Village. Wow. So crazy, it's all cleared out. Okay, let's look at this to see what progress they have here. Here is a progress from this angle. Okay, it looks like the whole loop has now been removed for Montezuma's Revenge. I do not see any of the loop anymore. But so far, everything else looks like it is still here, except for the loop. All right, for dinner, we got food at the cantina and we tried the carne asada nachos. The nachos came with carne asada, sour cream, guacamole, some pico de gallo, and cheese. And to be honest, they were fine. I give them like a three out of five, but I do think Knott's has like a lot of better options, so I would try something else. And also, they do get cold kind of fast. All right, so good news, even though Fiesta Village is currently under construction, the mariachis, angelitas, are now performing at Calico Square. And the crowd is even bigger over here, so that's so cool. So if you want to see them, they are still here performing in Calico Times Square. They even got all the kids hyped when they played the Baby Shark song, so that was super cute as well. a little break. Jenny noticed this room and it does look a little scary. We should go see what's inside. Let's come in here. So it says the gun shop and I guess this is where they would come and build it. It's so dark in here though. You could just... <laughs> Jenny! <laughs> <laughs> okay I'm sure a lot of you know this especially like if you come to Knott's often but in case someone does not here at the Boot Hill Cemetery, if you find this grave right over here, you can step in it and you can actually feel a heartbeat. It feels so creepy, but it is cool. But find this little grave, step in it, and you'll be able to feel it. Yeah. 
habíamos terminado Que nunca volverás Que nunca me quisiste Se me olvidó otra vez Que solo yo te quise Jenny wanted a funnel cake and if you have never tried a funnel cake from Knott's they are so delicious we don't get them too often but if you're coming to visit you must try it so when we get the funnel cake we get the funnel cake with one topping and the topping we chose is boysenberry and we usually like put it to the side and it was so delicious it is just so good so we wanted one around 9 p.m. and we went to like two other locations we went to the one near the log ride and they had a long line we went to the one near Sutter's again a long line we also went to the one right here in ghost town grub and that one was empty. I can't say it's always empty because this is like my first time getting in a while but they do have three locations in not and this one like had absolutely no line when we went. Okay, so here is the location in Ghost Town. Ghost Town Grub as you can see only one family ordering right now and if you are curious about the prices we got a funnel cake for $14, a funnel cake with a topping by $15.50 and a fully loaded funnel cake that comes with ice cream and one topping for $16.50. summer nights they had Thomasina and she got the crowd going they're really good they play more alternative music um, they're playing some songs I haven't heard in a while like from the killers the yeah yeah yes friends from dad so that was super cool and they even had like the bandits like they were <laughs> rocking out so all in all such a good time <laughs> the crowds were pretty heavy for a Monday night. Um, I thought we were gonna be able to do some rides but the lines never died down so we just walked around had a meal and got a few updates. So for now don't forget to hit that notification bell hit that subscribe button because we're gonna have more videos coming soon. Until next time bye guys!